Hello Darts Nuts, welcome to Darts Review Channel. In this video I'm going to be having a look at the recently released Condor Axe Wing Slim Flights. I've already done quite a comprehensive review on the Condor Axe Flights before. I think I've done about two videos so I'll put a link up in the description to them. So this is just going to be a fairly quick one just to show you the new flights. And I did the video the other day of the package that I got from Trinidad Condor that so they sent me i think it was 20 sets of these uh, so there will be some giveaways coming fairly soon it's just getting the time to organize it all but for now let's check them out all right the flights are available in three sizes i've got two of the sizes the medium and the long and i haven't got any of the short now they're in three colors you got plain black plain white and the clear and the sizes are on the box and that is from the base of the stem to the bottom of the flight but I'll put a graphic up on the screen so you can see that so we'll have a close look at one of them and then I'll get you some of my uh, normal nylon stems and see how they compare in length to that Right, so this is the medium in the black colour and just to give you an idea, that's a, a standard 75 micron poly slim shape so it's not quite the same shape as them, this one kind of like flares out um, but got a little bit of flex to the stem and obviously you've got your perfect 90 degree angles there and a little bit of flex on the the wings as well and these kind of like channels cut in which i think just adds a little bit of aerodynamics and it also helps for the incoming dart to come in, in so it can travel down there without causing too much of a problem but very nice looking uh, setup and these are the the long in the white color so just to give you an idea it's not massively longer maybe about four mil but these are set up with a in-between nylon stem and a normal standard flight and I would say that it's probably closest to the medium and if I get a a medium nylon stem put that on it's not an exact match with the length to your normal setup but that's a, a medium nylon stem so with a slim flight it's longer than the long setup but not by a lot only maybe about a mil and a half if that and just in case you're wondering that's the medium 1.37 grams this is the long 1.48 grams and a normal nylon stem medium with a normal slim flight is actually quite a bit heavier 1.83 and an in-between nylon stem with a poly slim flight 1.59 so the condor axe are lighter all right i'll just have a few throws with them i actually had a few throws this morning um oh that was a bit wobbly well, i was waiting for me bacon to cook I came in here and I didn't have any lights on. I only had the light from the window. So I'll just have a couple of throws of these. And anyway, on the third throw, I hit a max. <laughs> so I was quite chuffed with that. It didn't look like I hit one light because I seen one dart hit go in the treble and I thought the other two would completely miss because they were all a bit of an angle. But when I got up to the board, I couldn't believe it. They were all in. Oh, 
but you can see how they're all leaning over and I think the only thing I can think of is that they're going through the air quite quick and normally I, I tend to like get a bit of floatiness from the standard shape flights whereas these ones have seemed a bit zippy so I think they're just hitting the board before they get a chance to like straighten up a little bit that's the only thing I can think of but I always tend to use standard shape flights anyway so it's just getting used to them I, I dare say if I played with these for a while I'd probably work out the best way for me to throw them and probably end up liking them but I think it's just because I've been used to throwing with standard shape that long that I tend to just stick with it so Is that another two in the treble 20 yeah so i'm just gonna leave it there <laughs>that you're going to learn anything much from me throwing them but I, th I think I might still play with these for a bit just to see what happens now normally I would put some different points on on the dart just to get rid of the lip but it's a flat bull nose barrel so it may cause more damage to them than like the ones I used before which were kind of like a, a little bit more streamlined and I also put the Harrow's Apex points on to get rid of the lip and that's why I think those ones have lasted so long I think over two years I don't know where I've put them I can't see is that I'm down there oh no it's not but anyway the, them ones have lasted really well now I'm going to keep throwing with these just for the sake of testing them with that setup and I'll leave it as it is and we'll see how long how long these ones last I can't imagine they're gonna last two years like the other ones have but anyway there you go if you want to see the more in-depth review on the Condor Axe system you're probably best off checking the other videos this was kind of like a quick update on the new wing slim version um, like I showed you the other day the package that I got from Trinidad Condor darts I got quite a few of these so i will be doing some giveaways pretty soon so look out for that i'll see you on the next one happy darting